Hey everyone, it's uh, Greek Elite here from uh, Bodybuilding.com. I'm here to review uh, Isatori's Eat Smart Protein Bar, and this is actually a blind, or as blind as it can be, kind of taste comparison, where I have also a Detour Bar, a Supreme Protein Bar, and, and an OEM Bar, and uh, these all revolve around a chocolate, caramel, peanut, nut sort of flavor, so it's uh, all in the same family. And uh, I just want to say thanks again to Isatori for letting me uh, review this. And uh, hopefully this uh, turns out all right. What I have here in front of me is a piece of each. So, you know, OEM bar right in front of here. And I also have a cup um, in front of each. On the bottoms of the cups, I have written, say, a number, uh, one through four. And um, I don't know what the numbers are because I mixed them up already. And um, <clears throat> I'm basically going to go back and watch the videos later and um, put my comments and associate to the number in each one. So. Um, the first one going in is the OEA bar um, into whatever cups. And I'm going to mix them up and be random and uh, show them that way. So it's just going to um, kind of try and mix it up so I don't know which is which. And uh, that way I at least can give a, at least an honest, or try to be you know, as honest as it can be with it and uh, completely random. So, all right, so when the fun is. Alright, so the first one went in. So it has a bit of a crisp flavor to it, or a crisp uh, texture. Kind of a little much on the chocolate flavor. Um, I'm a big chocolate fan, which is really weird for me to say that then, but um, it's pretty sweet. A little bit of a chalkiness on the aftertaste, um, but overall okay. Yeah, I would say maybe like 8 out of 10. Um, but the texture's really good, so it seems like it would be a really filling bar. Next one. This one also has um, kind of a crisp to it, kind of like a nice crispy tree kind of thing, like I don't know, but the harder crisps. Um, but this one's very good. Yeah, it's a good mix of chocolate and peanut butter. Um, another really sweet, no chalky aftertaste or anything left in your mouth. And um, you know, from the texture, it also seems like it'd be very filling. So um, when I do the final reviews and eat the rest of the bar, we'll see how filling they are. But this one's uh, very good, actually. This one's a little tougher to chew. Oops, sorry. A little tougher to chew, but um, it seems like I have like real peanuts in it, which is really good. I like that. You know, if it's natural, things will like, but it tastes really good. Not too much on a chocolate flavor. I think the peanut kind of takes takes over the flavor. Um, it's not too bad, but so I like a little chocolate in there. Um, peanuts get stuck in your teeth, though. It's a big pain. Um, but overall, okay as well. It's really hard to chew. This one basically has no texture to it. It just tastes like, you know, just like straight compacted kind of bar. So there's no crisp, no nuts in it or anything else like that. So that's a kind of a negative on that. The flavor's kind of bland, not too much. Um, <coughs> overall, so so maybe like a seven out of ten. Um, and a little bit of an aftertaste, again, a little chalkiness afterward as well. But um, I'd say that my two favorites would have to be the two that were in the middle. Um, they're kind of tied to whichever those were. Uh, whichever one had the, was the second crisp one, and then the one with the real nuts in it. I think I picked that up correctly. Um, but those two are very good. Definitely like the flavors on that. So um, I'll have to look and compare the uh, nutritional profiles of each one, and then you know, look back and see as to which I put into which cup. And uh, you know, give a overall com 
overall rating. But uh, this is my version of a blind taste test and uh, hopefully helped. Thanks.